quickly before we move off the racism thing, I might as well, might as well quickly touch on it. This black fishing thing with Jesse Neeson, right? Right. Just yeah. quickly. Shambles. How do you guys feel about it? <laughs> yeah, she's no. Nah. Uh, it's just a bit cringy, man. Her saying that. What was she saying again? She was just saying, "Oh yeah." All my friends say, oh, you can't be white. You can't be white. You look black. Like, that's like, oh, man, like, just shut up. <laughs> like, it's bad enough you've got a song with P. Diddy. Like, just go off of that. Like, just milk it for that. Don't now try and do a bit more. But then I heard, I was listening to something else. I can't be plugging other podcasts. But yeah. Say, fuck it. Um, and then they were like, everyone be careful. Don't hate it so much that it goes to number one. <laughs> <laughs> Oh like, all, god! You've got a point because all all press is good press. Yeah. So have you got an issue with it, with her trying to be black? Cut. Oh, go on. Sorry. No, we good, man. No, because I I don't actually get the issue with someone trying to be black. Like, is that not imitation? Is like, this is a compliment. See, there's the problem. Uh, look, like me as a person, like. It doesn't really. It's for me. It's like, what, 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 why are you doing that? Number one, like you're white. Just, just be white. Like, why are you trying to? Because basically, she's made herself look racially ambiguous. Like, we can, we can argue from now to tomorrow, but she has. Mm. She's tanned. She's tanned herself overly. Bro, her and Nicki Minaj were the same color. In fact, she might have been a bit darker than Nicki Minaj. But what's the issue with that? Like, I've got, issue... I know plenty of black girls that put a lot of light of foundation on because they want to look a little bit lighter. I'm not saying they want to look white, but we can't have it both ways where Jesse is putting on more tan to look a little bit more darker. Mm. Well, it, like, the problem is kind of intertwined there because obviously before it was European beauty stands and all that stuff. And then uh, all, like they, everyone wanted to make themselves look a lighter complexion because mm. of all that beauty standard stuff. I think the issue is, and obviously I think this is from the black women's perspective, is that she gets all the benefits of being a white person, but then she can then almost culture vulture and make herself seem racially ambiguous and black and get all the benefits of being, I guess, a cool black person as well. And they feel like that's unfair. And, and I understand that as well. And obviously yeah. it's hard, it's hard for us as, I guess, as guys to, to be as angry. Yeah. But when it's like, if say for example, there's a, let's say there's a comparative um, black woman who's also an artist. Yeah. She's looking at us and thinking, Okay, I might, she might be a better singer than, than Jessie, but Jessie's got on this opportunity because she's white, but not only is she white now, she's making herself look black and then singing black music and she's just, she's just, she's just literally finessing the entire system. And Bro. then that's why they have, I think that's the main That sounds so dumb issue. to me, man. Like, everyone's entitled to their opinion and you can cancel whoever you want to cancel. But to me, one, I don't think it's that deep. I think she wants to just look a certain way and that's what she that's what she's doing two if she wants to play, make black music it's not her fault that people are feeling it and going to buy it like yeah no nah, I'm, I'm not on i'm not on this black fishing thing i think uh, one i think it's a compliment or? i think i think it's a compliment to be honest but maybe i'm being naive about it yeah i, I don't why 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 is it offensive for someone to try and look or be like you no it's an interesting question but i just i just thought i've always thought it was weird more than i i'm, mm. I'm more finding it weird than offensive mm. like why are you pretty much darkening your complexion and trying to look racially ambiguous you're mm. white I we all know you're white I why are you trying to make yourself look mixed race but if she's grown up on black music which she says she has yeah why wouldn't she why why can't she make black music like why can't she make hip-hop r&b no she can yeah but i think it was the extra adding of the i think do you know what made it worse it's when they're side by side nikki and her mm. and she's pretty much almost darker than nikki mm. like and then the way she's dressing like it just it just i can understand why yeah black females would be very annoyed especially considering opportunities as well i'd love to have a black female mention in our comments and explain tell us what explain I mean. what the because like i say maybe i'm being naive about it but to me i can't see 
where the issue is. Everyone should be allowed to do what they want to do with their life. If she wants to look this way, if she wants to do black music, why are we always getting offended at everything? I agree with you, Del. I've just, I've, like, I listen to what black women have to say. And like their argument is that she is basically making money off our culture. Yes. In their eyes, it's like, this is ours, yeah? And you're coming in, you're doing, pretending to be ambiguous. That's the key yeah, word, pretending. Yeah. Pretending to be whatever you might say that you're trying to be. And then you're going to make loads of money. And then when you make this money, you're going to disappear. Take your money back to, to, to your white side or whatever. It's like, you're not going to do anything to help the black community with this money or whatsoever. And in their eyes, it's like, you're just using us and our culture like cool you might like rap music but it doesn't necessarily mean that you fuck with us like I, like I don't know the ins and outs between the beef between her and Leanne or whatever this thing is but it's there's obviously something there and the fact that like I feel like I feel like if people if her girl was like look nah she's cool she's blessed but the fact that her black mate that she was in the band with is saying do 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 yeah but that girls are just bitchy in it like they've split up for a reason I agree with you. I don't care. Like, if I saw yeah, a yeah. white guy coming out and doing rap bars and wearing black clothes, and if he, I don't yeah. see black guys tanning, I, I, just, I just think it's funny. And it's I like your thing. I don't like that we section this is black culture, this is black music, this is white culture, this is white music, because that's never been the case. Like, Tion, Tion Wayne, for example, his audience is a lot of white youths. A lot of white use, a lot of black use, but a lot of white use as well. So are we now saying that he needs to spend money? Like what? What Yo, is his, his, his music? Isn't white music? Mm. It's black music. I, I get what you're saying, though. But at the same time, I also get what the the reason for the outcry. Number one, it's just weird that you're trying to make yourself a different. Race. If it wasn't, it's if it not wasn't weird an issue, though. It's just wait. If it wasn't an issue, just making yourself look if, how you want to look. Yeah, but if it wasn't a big deal, then she wouldn't do it. No, but what I'm saying is... There's clearly a benefit to her doing it. Girls tan all the time. Just because she wants to go a darker tan, what is the issue with that? It's not just the tan. It's the tan, it's the hair, the curly hair. She's trying to make the bad. The, the, but they hate that bad boys. And they're like, you're using black guys as bad boys. Again, yeah, yeah, I defended yeah. it because I was like, there's a couple of white guys there and they're just being mixed up. I feel like you guys are just looking specifically for the black guys. There were white guys there too, but... Let's, let's hope we have some tweets and some DMs about it. Mm. Yeah. Very I'm intrigued, yeah. but Dale, if, if I can, I, I, I can understand why people will be angry. Though. I just, I don't understand why you wouldn't understand. Dale doesn't. Dale was kind of like with me, and this is kind of like it's not. It's kind of, kind of like the LGBT. Yeah, thing but they're, they're, she's basically being an invader. She's coming, like like you said, she's coming in, yeah, pretending to be one of us. Yeah, like, like, I'm just, I'm just talking about it very broadly. Like this is necessarily what? my opinion. Why is she being an invader though? Like because she's not black. But, but that's just. Why does she have to be black to make black music? She doesn't have to be. The, no, that's it then. That's no, 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 over. The, the point is, is that she, the, this is the reason why people are angry. I'm trying to explain it. There, she already has an advantage being white as it is. That's not her it's. fault. That's not her fault. That's fine. She's now pretending to be black. She, yeah. Okay. That's that. I don't. I don't like that. Though. Okay. That's that's what people are accusing her of. She's pretending to be black, right? Making this music. Like Mike said, she's gonna come in, capitalize off. Her already her, her base from the white side come into the black side capitalize off that and use that for her benefit and then just fuck off and do what she wants i think that's the main uh, argument but it's again it goes back to like this this whole lgbt thing that we've we're talking about why yeah. why are we splitting the cultures why are we making it a white and black thing why can't she just go into a culture or why can't she just make music why can't she just make whatever music she wants to make why does it have to be black fishing yeah but you you say why can't why can't it but don't, that's what it is we, black music hip-hop r&b that's black music yeah but it doesn't mean that I, like if i wanted to go, grow up and do hip-hop r&b i can't go into that line well, of, of work you can. like there's bare people that that do that so yeah anyways to be, anyways to be fair, you have a point because it, like you got guys like Rd and H and, and, H, and they've come in and they've like even though they've they're still very blatantly white. Yeah, they still receive a bit of flack. I mean, if um, you go to deep it, Justin so, Timberlake's been doing it for years, I and mean, we all love Justin yeah. Timberlake. Mm. So, well, he kept. That's the thing, though. He kept it. He's, Justin he's, Bieber's done a lot of like R and B sort of stuff, but yeah. But there's been no shape shifting. Mm. There's, been, there's been no Lord. That nigga dances better than a white guy should. 
Tim Justin. Yeah, man, he brocks it down. Wait, Timberlake or, or Bieber? <laughs> Both. <laughs> Oh, yeah, to be fair. They're, they're wavy, man. That, that journals <laughs> album, that journals album, just not Justin Bieber, yeah. Oh, yeah, I was banging that out, do reckon, bro. Do you reckon there's like a, a group of black people who audit like Justin Bieber and Justin Timberlake and uh, their videos? Like, hmm, he's dancing <laughs> a bit too black. <laughs> hey, that's, that two steps hey. looking a bit too good. Hey, hey, hey Mr. Hey. B. <laughs> You better miss a beat. That's what it is with that Jesse Nelson on that. Hey. That's a bit too black. Mm, what's going on here? Mm. What do you mean? Why are you frying why are you frying some jerk chicken in the background? What are you doing there? Mm. How's your hair extra curlier today? Mm. 